So hello everyone. Today we are going to solve two one six four question number of lead code, and that is sort even and odd indices independently. So basically, in this question, you are given a zero indexed integer array nums rearrange the values of nums according to the following rules. Okay, we have given a basically nums array, and we have to rearrange it according to the rules which is given. Sort the value of at odd indices. Uh, of nums in non increasing order means in this example 4 1 2 3 we have odd like uh, 1 and 3 are in odd indices like 0 1 2 3 these are the indices of this this nums array and 1 and 3 uh, are in odd indices like added, uh, are in odd places so we have to uh, we have to sort odd indices in non increasing order uh, okay so basically the uh, first odd indices have uh, contains the largest elements in all odd indices elements okay so we have three at first place and so on one and lesser than the one again and again and again okay and uh, sort the values of even indices of nums in non-decreasing order non-decreasing means uh, uh, increasing basically so okay so four one two three that is two one four three 4 and the value of 4 and 2 become 2 and 4 because this is increasing order okay written the array <coughs> formed after rearranging the values of nums okay so let's check the given example 4 1 2 3 so basically 4 and 2 uh, have indexes 0 and uh, 2 yes and we have to make it all the uh, even that is 0 and 2 both are even numbers so uh, we have to make this sequence in increasing order that's why 2 and 4 coming in the place of 4 and 2 and in place of 1 and 3 it becomes 3 and 1 because it should be uh, definitely in decreasing order so that's why uh, element in index 1 and 3 uh, and and 1 and 3 is in decreasing order hope you guys understand this question this is uh, uh, let let you try this question after this uh, we we will try to solve this okay so pause this video try it out and resume it after a few minutes of trying this question so hope guys you tried this question so for me i think this question requires two priority queues one is that is of odd priority queues which takes the element uh, in odd places like in first place this and in third place this all the elements in odd places and uh, uh, another priority queue that is that uh, that contains all the elements of even indices like 4 and 2 these are in even places and uh, in even places we have that condition we want first element mean in uh, in even places we have to make sure that all the even places element must in increasing order uh, that means topmost element the first element we got uh, in even places should be the smallest of all the even places so let me write some few line of code so that you can understand it even better so first create the priority queue and that is even that is equal to a new priority queue and uh, new priority oh what is the spelling of priority man okay so priority queue okay and that is simply normal priority queue which which gives us the smallest element at very first place of whatever in this priority queue and again we will copy the same code and paste it and we have to make this equal to not even that's odd because in this case we have uh, we want it get all the elements in odd indices and we have to write down uh let's write this instead of collection dot reverse order uh eight question mark a, a uh, comma b and that is a, a b minus a okay so we can write this yes this will gives us the elements which is the maximum in this array and be, just because in all odd indices indices we wanted the maximum of all in first you know in first place so that's why we have we have we have written this this will give uh, this is basically a max heap which gives the maximum element in top of uh, at very first place okay so first we have to add all the elements uh, let me write this okay so 
okay so we have to make sure that if if i to that is equal to zero have to add it in even uh in even priority queue we have to add that element in even priority queue uh, that means if uh, i let's suppose i value of i is zero and that is zero two and this is equal to zero so this is yes this is equal to zero so we have to add it in even priority queue and if it is not equal to zero we have written we, we will write this equation that if, if it not equal to zero we have to add it in odd add okay so <clears throat> now elements in even priority queue we have uh, one and three and uh, elements in odd priority queue we have four and two hmm. because this is in even place this is in even place nee, uh, no sorry sorry zero four and two is in even place so uh, a little silly mistake here we are facing one and three okay so in odd places this element we have and in uh, even places this one we have okay so now we add all the elements into both the priority queues separately according to the uh, to the condition uh, given in the question now we have to make sure we have to write again this uh, let me write this then i will explain you now if if the value of i uh, when we divide this uh, percentage to 2 and if that is equal to 0 that means if, uh, if this this will condition of a uh, uh, even uh, you know even elements elements in even position in this case we will simply make nums i that is nums of 0 nums of 0 means 4 and uh, that is equal to even and pole let me explain you uh, this means this condition is of even so in even condition the smallest element will come at the very top of the place uh, of that priority queue so in 4 and 2 the element is smallest in between 4 and 2 that is 2 so this will come up at the top of the uh, top of uh, even priority queue so we will just uh, remove that element from even priority queue and makes it equal to nums i that is uh, that is uh, that is basically even numbers i hope you understand this one and when this is not equal to uh, zero that means it's an odd indices so in this case we will nums i equal to and that is equal to odd pole and this because in nums uh, uh, in nums uh, in odd priority queue we have to make sure that top uh, maximum element will comes in top of the place so we just remove that element from odd priority queue and makes it equal to nums i uh, according to this question we we have one and three and uh, as given in the uh, in as given in the condition that all the elements in odd indices we have to uh, remove it sort it in the order of non increasing that means the maximum element will come in first place of odd indices and and, and smaller than that will come another odd indices so it, this will give us exactly the same uh same whatever whatever is the requirement and again at last we will let it out nums okay so hope you guys understand this question this is one of the important question and let me explain you again we created two priority queue even and odd even priority queue will give us the smallest element of that priority queue whatever we inserted in it and in odd priority queue we have the largest element which is in priority queue it will give us and here we we add both we have all the elements into even an odd priority queue all the elements that is equal that that's give us uh, that is uh, you know even we will add it here and all the element that is odd we add it here again we make equal to nums i that is um, according to the given question okay so at last we return out nums so let's run this code and uh, it must be run uh okay so here sorry it's nums dot length and it accepted and it's successful so i hope you guys 
understand this question if you have any any doubt regarding this question just comment out thanks for watching this video